can you introduce yourself ma'am yeah i'm arunima gupta and i run a dance uh, school called the florin coachin it's been 10 years that i'm in coachin 10 years <laughs> yeah and <laughs> okay. uh, i think my studio was the first to start zumba in coachin okay. and i'm also a contemporary dancer uh-huh. so my studio is all about contemporary and zumba and uh, being a contemporary z- dancer zumba was quite a bit of shift from me because i'm trained in classical in ballet from there to do zumba was quite a big step 10 years i've been doing it continuously enjoying it to the hilt and all those people who have worked with me and those who practice zumba at the floor they are mm-hmm. all like they love it it's right. been my journey for the last 10 years here in kochi that's good so uh, you face many malayalis who are coming yeah. to your mm-hmm. uh, dance floor mm-hmm. what is a like popular thing they will ask about zumba um because when i started the uh, floor and i introduced zumba literally um i mean people took it as a rage they love the songs because as you know shweta also said that music is the soul of zumba mm-hmm. and we take international music mm-hmm. so music from uh, you know like beyonce maybe you can have uh, black eyed pea we have uh, shaggy all these people coming in for the you know music so music is the heartbeat of zumba So yeah. this is international music so when people came in there's always a demand for bollywood because in india that's what we recognize yeah. zumba also has a you know it's a mix of different varieties of music rhythms so we do have bollywood also okay. so when i started i used to always have one or two bollywood numbers in my class so people could feel the local flavor and enjoy but slowly as time came in they started enjoying the international music Okay. because we have a lot of latin american music mm-hmm. a lot of caribbean music hip hop music so they and started enjoying those and now my people of course they're mostly malayalis there are north indians too a lot mm-hmm. of course there's a big crowd but even whether they're malayali or non malayali it's a global music and they enjoy being global being that flavor of from all different places and what is so interesting about zumba is just not one kind of movement is going on because we go to see any other place class after while the movements are monotonous whether you know like mm-hmm. anything it's the same kind of movement what attracted me uh, to zumba as a dancer because i get to dance different rhythms different flavor see the one dance maybe we do merengue okay which is a dominican republic dance mm-hmm. the next is salsa then is cumbia again from dominican republic then we have reggaeton when we some caribbean form we have got belly dancing sometimes we've got bollywood we have hip hop we've got soca we've got brazilian funk there are so many so in a zumba class uh, many people do not know what actually happens in a zumba class yeah, so in exactly. a zumba class uh, we have got 15 uh, varieties of song each from different parts of the world mm-hmm. and that wraps it up into a fitness package okay, okay. as yeah. it all depends upon like um, rating the heartbeat yeah increasing the heartbeat high and it's very scientific so there is always a warm up in a zumba class okay. and very well researched they know which movement and which you know body type can i mean what can suit your body so exactly that we have got squats lunges in the warm up mm-hmm. and uh, then we have the songs and a zumba class like when I mean, we have a licensed instructor and when we get that license the class that we are teaching here in india it is the same thing is taught all across the world every month there are new songs released into the market so all the instructors around the world are practicing the same songs yeah. so the format of the class is if there is a one high song the next next song is low, low. again high is intermittent way of going about with the class it increases the heart rate but not in a uh, kind of a frantic way mm-hmm. you don't feel yes. oh my god you're going to die right now uh-huh. because high and low so it's a good way of taking your heart heart rate high of course that's a lot of lung power and i suffer from asthma but after doing zumba i feel so much better because it increases your lung power